setting an ag line. All right, so what we've done, we've actually dug down, got our fall, got our water and all that to fall into the side here. And of course that comes off our name line and put an ag pipe line all the way down here. Now you still do need a fall with an ag line. You usually want about one to 100. So, you know, a centimeter fall at least for every meter of pipe, one. Two, we need it going down and it needs to pick up somewhere. It needs to either flow out to the front and be released out there or it needs to pick up a storm water or some other sort of drainage area. A little bit of gravel, we don't want too much. We only want a little bit under the ag line first. The ag line then actually goes on top in a nice compressed yet falling state. If you can see that, probably not that much, but we still want it falling. And then cover it, cover it with your drainage gravel on top so your water can actually come in here, penetrate, get into your ag pipe and start flowing where you want it to flow. That's how you install the ag line, making sure it's got the fall on it and making sure it's hooking up to some sort of storm water or somewhere area where it can actually flush out and get away from your home.